because I love talking about food, and so uh, I love fast food, too. However, what I'm reading here uh, makes me rethink it. We have uh, an award-winning author and speaker on healthy living, Judy Gammon. Good morning, Judy. How are you? Good morning. I have to tell you, you may love food, but it does not love you back. Not that fast food. No, it Nor doesn't. <laughs> it makes me it makes me feel really, really bad, too. And I have heard whispers of this uh, over the years, but I've never really heard it put exactly like you have described this. What's wrong with the wrappers on the fast food? Well, there are these substances, PFAS substances, and we know that they are no good. They're man-made, they're full of chemicals, and some of your favorites, Burger King, Wendy's, McDonald's, they're using these substances in their wrappers. And we, we've we really got to start paying attention. When we have food that's cheap, right, I mean, 99 cents, right. you have to think, what is that company going to pay to wrap it up? You know, they already are, are selling it on the cheap. They're not going to put any money into what they're using to wrap it. And that's where we get into these really inexpensive uh, styrofoams and plastic uh, induced wrappers and and papers. And really the, the, the whistleblowers, we got to give them a hands off. Sometimes we don't like these environmental people, um, but sometimes they do us a huge favor. And there's some environmental advocacy groups, uh, Toxic Free Future and Mind the Store, that really got out there and did their job. They got the word out and said, hey, we need to, to wake up. Not only are, are we having health issues because we're eating the fast food. That's right. But now we have to consider what are they wrapping it in? Yeah. What? I, okay. So now you're kind of making me understand it's just about the cost and that they're going to buy, you know, the cheapest wrappers. Um, so Burger King's Whopper, Burger King's Chicken Nuggets, and the cookies? Yeah. So Yeah, a- absolutely. And then you get into Wendy's, and it's the paper bag. So everything that they're putting in and passing through that drive through window or handing to you that comes in a paper bag has been exposed to these chemicals. Oh, no. You also have from mcdonald's the french fries <laughs> you had the french think, fries oh, from mcdonald's right <laughs> <laughs> oh i'll never be the same i'll never be the same so what happens to us if we do eat uh you know the the big mac other than the obvious we get fat there's a ton of salt i mean the food itself is bad for you what happens on top of that with these wrappers Well, what we've seen when we have chemical exposure to the human body is we see that the insides of the bodies, like the the gut microbiome, um, all kinds of things can be affected. We're not supposed to be walking chemistry projects. No. And and really, that's what happens when we when we consume chemicals, whether they're in these types of wrappers or they're in box foods in the in the stores, and. When we consume chemicals and it upsets that microbiome, it can affect everything from your mood to your risk for cancer and, and, and a whole host of other diseases. So we got, we got to wake up and, and start paying attention not only to what we're putting in our mouth, but what that food has been exposed to. I did an interview today and somebody brought up a very good point, and that is once you have This hot food, like you mentioned, the French fries, you put something that's been fried right inside of this, then you've created now heat on top of that chemical. We do know that anytime you have chemicals and you heat them, it creates a whole other problem. So, you know, the food is basically going into a a chemical steam bath. Okay. I'm never going to be the same. After talking to you, I'm never going to be the same. Uh, Can you give us any... Is there anything safe? Like, is Chick-fil-A doing this too? Well, Chick-fil-A was not in the the list. I, I will say you'll notice uh, when, when you look at the list of what um, they've listed, the, the Whopper and the Big Mac and the nuggets and the fries, and you think about that packaging, you think about that kind of waxy yes. um, feel. It, there's a particular feel that you immediately can can think of, whether it's the styrofoam little boxes or the um, the little paper like um, containers, they have a feel to them. And it's in on this list: the nuggets, the fries, the cookies, the 
the burgers, there's a common texture there. I'm not sure that you could necessarily feel those, but it does give you an idea. Okay. And, you know, basically the, the thing is, is, just stay away from the fast. <laughs> you know, all in all, there's just another reason. You are the best. Judy Gammon, thank you so much. You've give us, given us a lot to think about this morning. And uh, for sure, I'm going to stay away from the fries. And you've destroyed my Good life. On <laughs> Take care. Thank you. Okay, bye.